I'm Nastasia and this is Dorm Room DIY, where we show you how to transform your dorm room DIY style. Today we're meeting up with roommates Jay and Uriel and giving their dorm room a much needed upgrade. But before we start, let's get to know Jay. <laughs> Hi, my name is Jay, I'm a junior, and this is my dorm room. I feel that there is a lot of storage, but it's like suitcases, boxes, and it's not pleasing, so I don't like when people come and they are thinking it's a mess and I'm putting everything that I have under the bed. There is nothing like really attractive <laughs> uh, on the room. I just want like everybody to feel comfortable and stuff. I'm here in Jay and Uriel's room, and today, Jay, we're gonna start with you. So I know you like the whole bohemian style for your room. Yeah, I really like the bohemian, like, uh, chill vibe. Okay, and then I know you really wanna make your bed into more of a seating area so you can hang out with your friends. Yeah, I want, like, f kind of a couch so we can just, like, sit here and relax. Okay, so what if I told you that we could fix all of that in two hours for just $300? I would love to see it. All right, we're gonna get to work and we'll see you in a couple hours with a new dorm room. Well, let's do it. Now we are going to make some pillows for Jay's bed. For this project, you will need two small rugs, yarn, a yarn needle, and a pillow. First, lay your rugs in a plush shape. Then you want to fold the ends in like this. You will take your needle and yarn and stitch together three sides. Then you will stuff your pillow and stitch together the fourth side. In order to make his bed more of like a couch feel sitting area, we added a ton of pillows. Some of them are the DIY pillows that we showed you. To give him more of that bohemian feel, we added a tapestry to the wall. And to handle his under the bed mess, we did a DIY bed skirt. For this DIY, you're going to need the fabric of your choice, an iron, some hem tape, shower curtain rings, and an exacto knife. So we already pre-cut our fabric and we used our hem tape to make these nice clean edges. You just simply iron them on. We then took an exacto knife and cut out X's. And this is where you're gonna take your shower curtain rings and you're just going to loop them through those holes that you made and clip them on to the bottom springs of the bed. Lastly, he wanted his room to be a little bit more dark, so we added some blackout shades. Damn. I really like it. I really, really like it. I approve, yeah, for <laughs> sure. I like how it matches like with the carpet and also matches with the bed. Nobody sees what is under there. Oh my god, that's so nice. And I really like how she puts like she still incorporates what I had in my room, like in some some parts. And it's really comfortable. I can for sure hang out here. Like for sure. So Jay, what do you think? I really like it. I love the top three. I love the couch. Everything is so nice. Thank you. Well, thank you so much for letting us redecorate your dorm room. Make sure you stay tuned to next time to see how we decorate Uriel's side of the room. Thank you for watching. We hope this inspires you to redecorate your dorm room. I'm Nastasha, and this has been Dorm Room DIY on Awesomeness TV.